Icon finally picked up three points here at the Stade Michel Donano at the end of September, edging Amiens to snap a winless home run that stretched all the way back to March. They were looking to make it two on the bounce as Gangon came to town on Saturday. After kicking off the campaign with six defeats, the Brittany side have steadied the ship somewhat in recent weeks. They've taken five points from three outings, although they still came into this one bottom of the table. Both meetings between these two sides ending goalless last term. Well, the best chance of the first half fell to Kong captain Prince Onyange. Remarkable effort there from Etienne Dido and goalkeeper Carl Johan Jonsson to keep it out. Onyange from point blank range inside the six yard box. Came up off Dido and then punch clear by Jonsson. But it was a first half of precious few chances. Coaches Fabian Macadal and Antoine Combouare will know that I've had a few choice words for their players at half time. And the supporters at least managing to keep themselves entertained. Comboare's gang on side improved after the break. Dido winning the ball back here. Slipping through for Nicola Benazé. Natiel Julon. Unable to really get much power on that effort. Julon starting for the first time in Ligue 1 Conferama. In the absence of the suspended Marcus Turam and the injured Nolan Roux. Gangon looking increasingly assertive. They had another chance on the hour mark. The ball held up here by Jordan Nikoko. Acute back heel for Ludovic Blas. They eventually managed to get a shot away, but easy enough for Brees Samba. At the other end, Yassine Bamu tried his look from distance, 11 minutes from time. A low drive that almost caught out Jonsson. But ultimately it was a day to forget for both sides' front men. Enzo Crivelli unable to get on the end of this cross. He's chasing his first goal since early September. A final corner for Kahn came to nothing. And so it finished goalless, just as it did in both games last season. Kahn remain in the bottom half of the table while Gangon remained bottom.